All right, don't don't do that. Don't don't store your paints in the refrigerator. Hey everyone, this is Eric. I am an acrylic painter and a licensed artist with Disney Fine Art. All right, let's get to it. The best way I found uh, to store acrylic paint. Now, I've tried a bunch of different methods over the years. For a while, I was on those Stay Wet palettes. I don't know if you've seen those, but they're the kind of like plastic rubbery uh, containers where you put a sheet of paper and a little bit of a sponge underneath that and you just store your, your paint on top of that. I used that for a while, but what I found is the paints just kind of run into each other. You gotta have that, that moisture level, the sponge underneath, just perfect. And then over time, it'll start to kind of mold or mildew or something. You'll see a little growth that you have to wash out or, or change the sponge completely. So I decided to move away from that. And what I found several years ago has really changed the way I paint. So what I was looking for was a system that would allow me to paint for several days, maybe even weeks at a time. Uh, it would maintain the correct level of moisture uh, around the paints, and it also have several compartments so I could store paints in different areas and kind of trade those compartments out as needed. And this is what I found. It's, uh, it's called the Acrylamizer, and it's uh, by a company called Creative Mark. And I found it's just the best way to store your paints. It really allows me, like I said earlier, to, to maintain my paints for several days, even weeks at a time. And I've, I've got uh, several of these trays back there, and usually you'll find one or two filled with paints so that I can be working on, on one or two paintings at the same time. Now, this video isn't sponsored. I just really like this product. Let's dig in. All right, so some things it points out on the box. You can save your colors for up to two weeks. I found this to be true, definitely, and even in some cases, it can it can last a little bit longer. Um, extends the open working time for five hours. And then this next one is important. It says, never needs washing, paint just peels off, and I'll show you that. That's a, it's a really cool feature. So let's open it on up. All right, so it's this kind of acrylic case here that you can see, and it's got four little uh, handles around the outside edge. You gotta pop all those. That's the way you seal it later on. When you open it up, the first thing you're gonna see is this tray, which is uh, great for just uh, mixing uh, in general. And then uh, you'll see the system here. So what you've got are two different uh, rows with, with uh, different sizes there. And this top area is a little bit bigger uh, than the smaller area. I actually like to kind of I'm just gonna spin it around because this is how I use it like this. So you got three of these uh, pink containers, each containing seven, seven cups. So a total of 21 across the top. And then you have uh, these extra trays at the bottom. And I will use something like this if I'm mixing like a gradient between two colors and I need to have access to that entire gradient at any time. I can just store it in here from one color to the other. What I really love though are these paint cups. Like I said, you get seven, three small, and then uh, four slightly larger. And they're nice and deep, uh, which is great as well. And what I tend to do is, if you buy, say, more than one of these, you'll get, an, of course, another set of these three. And I like to just keep them stored up like this. So I keep the trays separate, but I will fill up a container uh, with all of these. So what you'll notice uh, first off is there's no sponge underneath, no dirty sponge, like some of those Stay Wet palette options. What I recommend doing is going to the grocery store and just getting one of those green and yellow sponges. And you just load this up with water and you place it in one of the trays and that will keep your paints good for, like they said, two weeks. As far as sealing it, something I like about this over those kind of stay wet systems is it's much easier to get this on and sealed. So on those other systems, this area can be flexible and it's hard to know that you've got it lined up. Here, it's easy. You just place it on top like this and once it's lined up, you just snap each of the sides and you're good to go. Uh, but sometimes uh, during the during the day, I might find myself with, with the top kind of just like loosely sitting on top or maybe even off completely as I'm, as I'm pulling trays in and out. What I like to use in that scenario is this particular uh, spray bottle. It's called an Aqua Mist, uh, M-Y-S-T. And what's really great about this is when you pull the trigger, the stream kind of comes out for a couple seconds. So let me show you here, you can see that. So you get a lot of water um, with each each trigger pull. And so uh, it's really great to just kind of dust off uh, the paints as you're working on them and kind of maintain that moisture level until you're done with the session and you can close this up and, and rely on the sponge. 
All right, so one aspect of the system that I really like is when it comes to cleaning. So rather than having to try to, you know, pour out your paints into some other container or some other way to dispose it, all you have to do is take the tray out of the box and then just let it sit for a couple days. Paint inside will dry, and then you can just use like a standard dental pick to kind of pry out uh, the paint at that point. It'll kind of just be like this little piece of rubber. After that, all you need to do is give it a good washing with um, some soap and water and you are ready to go for your next session. All right, so it's called the Acrylomizer from a company called Creative Mark. I will leave links to it below, as well as the uh, spray bottle that I mentioned. This is a really great system. If you're looking for a way to extend your paints so that you can work on a painting project for, for multiple days or even weeks, uh, this might be just what you're looking for. All right, take care.